And now to today's top story. Governor Jim Pillen is expected to announce former Senator Ben Sasse's replacement this morning. We've known from the start that former Nebraska Governor P. Ricketts was in the running. Yeah, and earlier this week, several other applicants were revealed. Channel East Daniel Kaiser joins us now live in studio with who could soon be re representing you, us, in the D.C. This all started back in October when we learned Sass was in the running to become the next president of the University of Florida. Since then, there's been a lot of speculation as to who would take his seat, with fellow Republicans even questioning if Ricketts was the right fit. Former state party delegate Jeremy Aspen told the Associated Press back in December, quote, it looks bad, it smells bad, what it looks like is two rich guys using their money and power to grab a Senate seat. He went on to say, quote, this is how authoritarian countries operate. Ricketts previously donated more than $100,000 of his own money to Pillen's campaign for governor. Some of the other candidates that could get the nod today include former Senate State Senator Brett Lindstrom, Ann Ashford, who is the widow of former Representative Brad Ashford, and Melody Stanford, who was a news director in North Platte, who got fired for helping collect signatures for a ballot initiative aimed at banning abortions. The event for today's announcement begins at 9 a.m. at the state capitol. We'll have the latest updates online as well as on air here on Channel 8. Back to you guys. All right, Danielle, thank you very much.